wonder, Cammie, if you can relate to that, because obviously with a Hockey Hall of Fame career as a player, those skills are going to transfer into your job as the first ever female NHL pro scout. But how has it been for you in Seattle in your new role? Um, you know what? There is a learning curve, definitely. You have to be really patient. But, but in the essence of the job is just analyzing hockey. And that's something that I've done just naturally as a player. Um, with brothers and coaching and just with dinner table talk with my husband and analyzing the game and analyzing players was fun for me. And so when I got to do it for a job, it was like, this is amazing. Um, and I got really good advice and, you know, I have great leadership above me uh, to guide me along. And so for me, it's, it's been smooth. There's um, I didn't realize the attention that would be drawn to it. I didn't think about that part. So I do feel you know, as a female, you do have to represent and, and show other girls um, that this is now a job opportunity for them. And it, I think the, one of the really cool things that I noticed, I went out, I was on a panel in Seattle with all the scouts. We just went to some, an auditorium and we're talking and there's a little girl in the front and at the very end, they asked her, her to ask the question and she said, how do you become a, a scout? And I thought, this is really cool because it now gives other uh, paths for women in, in the game of hockey and in sport. So um, I do feel that part as well um, for representing, but I also do know as a hockey player, it's, um, it's very natural. And I just, you know, I'm, I'm being patient with my learning curve. Like I know the more, the more reps I get with, with um, my reports, the, the more easy it is to do. And um, I'm having a lot of fun. And it, again, it's a great organization to be a part of. 